Hello friends! Welcome to Art Series. My name is Miss Jessica. I'm Miss Elizabeth. And we're so happy you're here. This month we are going to talk a little bit about an artist named Rene Magritte. Elizabeth, would you like to tell us about him? Yes, he's one of my favorite artists of all time and here is some information about him. René Magritte was born in 1898 in Belgium. He attended the Brussels Academy of Fine Arts as a young man and then worked designing wallpaper and creating artwork for advertisements. His artwork was initially inspired by other artists' depictions of familiar objects in unusual or dreamlike arrangements. Rene Magritte experimented with different techniques and styles throughout his career, but the majority of his work was part of the Surrealist movement, which is the artistic movement for which he has become best known. Surrealism is an artistic movement that rejects logic, convention, and reality in favor of the unconscious, the unconventional, and the unexpected. Surrealism emphasizes dreams, thought, and instinct, and surrealist artists let dreams and thought guide their artwork without trying to exercise much control. It is meant to release ideas, images, and dreams buried within the mind. Rene Magritte used many recurring images in his surrealist artwork, such as apples, bowler hats, trains, castles, and birds. He loved the sea and the sky, and those images are present in many of his paintings. He also incorporated words into many of his paintings. He stated that he wanted his art to challenge the real world, challenge perception. The mystery and originality of his work has made Rene Magritte a powerful influence on many other prominent artists. Rene Magritte's artwork started to gain more popularity towards the end of his lifetime, and the artwork has remained popular and well known to this day. That was so great. Thanks, Elizabeth. Okay, now for every art series, you know we talk about the artist, and then we also have a bag full of goodies that you can come to the library and get. And they have. A little bit more information about our artist. We've got your pin if you're collecting your pins featuring a piece of art from the artist. So cool. I love it. And then we always give you a special craft. Miss Elizabeth, do you want to show us our special craft? All right. Our craft for this month is a painting craft. Yay. Sponge painting actually. And we've included enough stuff for you guys to make two separate paintings. So everything is in there, cardstock, um, the templates all traced and ready for you to cut out, paint and sponges so you can make your own versions of these. And here is how we made ours. And that's how we did it. So if you would like to do one of those projects for your very own, come down to the children's department and say hi and see us and we'll give you one of these bags filled with everything you need to do that project. Thank you for joining us this month in learning about Renee Magritte. And we like to sign off like usual. With our favorite quote. Every, Every child, child is, is an artist. artist. By Pablo Picasso. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. Bye friends. Bye friends.